Welcome back to my channel. Happy New Year. Welcome to 2022. Guys, we finally made it to 2022 and I'm so excited. I'm so happy to move into 2022 with you guys. This year is going to be much better than 2021. This year is going to bring much more achievements for all of us. Every small YouTuber out there, we're going to attain our goals by the grace of God this year. I don't know, I'm so excited. I don't know. I have this feeling that maybe one of my videos may go viral. <laughs> but anyways, um, I can't think straight because you know that's you know I don't know every new year I just feel like this just like so I'm in a new year actually I'm in a new year God took me over from 2021 to 2020 so a lot of people died yesterday night a lot of people couldn't make it till today but it's like God made it possible for us to enter the new year please if you haven't thanked God of this video or turn off this video and go and thank God because he's a mighty God so guys um this year is going to come with a whole lot of things. I'm going to be going back to school next week. Today is the first, so I decided to film for you guys on the first, to start my vlog on the first. And um, I went yesterday, which was the first, to buy a whole bunch of things because today, which is the first, the market is not going to be open. So I had to rush yesterday and buy most of my school stuff so I couldn't vlog. I'm going to be having my exams from the 10th of January. And then after that, we're going to start our second semester for 300 level before we go for an internship. So this year is going to be should I say overwhelming? I don't know. But then I pray that you know I reach a certain goal for my YouTube by the grace of God. I hope to be very consistent for you guys. I hope to create content that you guys love and appreciate. And I hope to entertain you guys as well as entertain myself. We do a mini haul of everything I got yesterday. My bag is not the nicest. I have everything inside here. Yes, it's a Saxa Motors. So the first thing I have here is one cheap perfume that I got. It's very cheap. I got it. I just liked the scent, so I got the perfume. This is what the perfume looks like inside. Inside here, I have my nose mask. I didn't buy a packet. A packet was 4,000, and I wasn't ready to buy a packet. I bought half, which was 2,000. 25 pieces. Yeah, let me put it back. My soap. Bathroom slippers. The next thing I have here is my hair bonnet. This was not a specific hair bonnet that I wanted to get. Wait, let me try it on. I've never tried it on. I wanted something more loose. Like I don't know. I don't know if I wanted something black and more loose. This is too small. It won't be able to like contain all the like my braids or I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Hair extensions. My attachments that I was using to make my hair. The hair extensions that I got. I just got two. Because I didn't want my hair to be too full. I didn't want it to be heavy. Like, I've made a hair with three at, um, hair attachments before. And it was way too heavy for me. I was having a whole lot of headache. And after that, there was, like, only two. Like, it's just... It's very, very hard for you before you see me, like, making three attachments. I got these sandals. This wasn't the specific sandals that I wanted. But I was going around the market. You know, I wear a size 43. And... I kept going from shop to shop and they're telling me we only have 42, we only have 30, sorry, we only have 39, 37, 40. I was like, they don't have like big sizes for the ones I like, so I had to just get this one. Then I got these slippers. I love these so much. I like them. This was the first time I saw a sandals that actually entered me because my leg is kind of weird. Um, I wear a size, big size 42. But when there's no 40, big size 42, I wear a 43. And then another thing with my leg is that my leg is like wide. It's not just long it's wide at the same time the next sandals i have here i like this one so much i liked it although i was having second thoughts when i wanted to get this one i was like i wanted a plain black and i was like oh my god this one will be nice you know how they can market their goods and they were like okay this one's going to be good with, um, for your size it's going to be like it's going to pop out your your leg your skin color something so i had to get this one i liked it see this chanel they wrote here <laughs> proudly made in um Asia states Chanel. Probably Abia said Chanel. <laughs> Tell me the one you like in the comment section so that I will know. I got this Mega Growth hair shampoo. 
from my hair because it has been way long that I got my shampoo. Ever since I traveled and came back, I've never bought shampoo since then. I've always been going to um, salons to wash my hair. And I just decided to get this for Babcock because I won't be going to the salon every day to wash my hair. So this should be good. Mega go to Tangling Conditioner. Yixia Wax and Mod. You guys should definitely get this um, edge control. I know we girls like, you know, doing our edges a lot. I recommend you guys use this um, edge control because you know these ones that have like, they have different color color variations. Like, this one has like blue cover, yellow cover, purple cover. You guys should not get those ones. Those ones, after applying them or doing your edges to them, when you go under the sun, it's it turns white and my friend got this um, edge control and i took it from her room i was like okay i'm going to use it once and return it back and then i used it once and it was very good i went under the sun my head didn't turn white you know when you got on the sun with edge control and it turns white it didn't turn white and i was like okay i'm not returning this edge control to you i like the edge control so it was not like okay you can have it and then i went to the market and i saw it i was very surprised to see it because she was telling me that she only that she saw it in lagos and she couldn't find it in abia state so i was so excited to get this you guys should definitely get this so guys that's basically everything for my mini haul if there's any other thing i'm going to buy and i add to what i've bought i'm going to show you guys in this video um i've not packed anything yet my box is still the same way i bought it last semester i haven't sorted out the clothes i'm going to be going back to uni with and um it just oh my god next week school oh my god <gasps> exams oh my god god oh my god so guys um you guys are going to be seeing more of school content this time around i'm going to write an exam so i don't think the first or second week of january is going to be a time to vlog for me it's going to be a time to focus and write my exams and read and i'll be back to film for you guys after the exams hopefully um i pray to be consistent this year i want to be more consistent this year should i start packing now i don't even know today is saturday first and then tomorrow is sunday and I, I i didn't want to waste my day tomorrow i want to read and then tomorrow monday i'm going to make my hair and then tuesday no i don't want to waste my day on tuesday i want to read wednesday i want to, on fifth that day i'm going so, okay i think i'm going to pack today i think i'm going to arrange my day today because i never want to waste any of my days like this year we're going to be productive not slacking i don't usually cry at all okay Let's stand up. Guys, this is how my bag has been since I came up from school. I know it's not scattered, it is. Oh my god. Everything, scatter. My bag everywhere. Like, I don't even know what's at this part of the box. What's inside here? Oh my god. I don't want to go deep into this, but I'm going to clean it and then. Where's my flash one? I don't know. But I'm going to clean it and then, yeah. You guys are going to do this together with me. hey guys good morning this is tuesday the 4th of january and yesterday i went to go and braid my hair i couldn't film the whole process because making this hair was very very painful very much painful i won't lie to you guys and remember in this video when i mentioned that i'm going to only be using i'm only going to be using two um hair extensions that was a lie i made use of two and a half and to be honest this hair cannot even pack like it can even tie up twice and it's a bit heavy for me but i had to go with it because the um the woman i was braiding my hair was like two is not going to be enough two is not going to be enough and i had to just use two and a half and this is what my hair looks like this is the current length of my hair i know most of you guys will come for me in the comments and say oh you're not carrying the vapor compliant hair but don't worry i'm going to be packing it very well and then i'll um pack it in a donut form that will be popcorn compliant so um i would love to see your different opinions about my hair in the comment section whether you liked it or not because me this hair is so nice it's i like my hair so um this morning i'm going to go and run some bank errands um i don't i'm not sure i'm going to film that but if i film that i'm going to put that in this video um if you haven't subscribed up until this point please subscribe to my channel if you love my content um don't forget to Follow me on Instagram to stay updated and 
let's start going because I may be going to school tomorrow or next tomorrow. So let's start moving. <laughs> guys this is my last night in my house before i go back to the ghetto which is school i know why was i looking down this is my last night in this room before i go back to school i haven't finished packing yet let me just put my two remaining bubble gowns inside my box before i close up the box i know i'm settled with that i'm going to be leaving tomorrow morning my boss is leaving by 7 45 and tomorrow's um, travel is going to be a long one. It's going to be a long journey because I'm leaving from Abia State to Ogun State. And that's quite a distance. It's going to last for like, let me say, 8 hours or maybe close to 10 hours. Let's say 10 hours or 9 hours or 8 hours. I don't even know. So um, I'm just going to pack up the remaining stuff and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. I'll see you guys tomorrow morning before I travel. I'm going to meet up with my friends. I'm leaving my friends. You guys will definitely see them in the vlog. If you guys don't see them, you guys will see them in Babcock when we get to Babcock. So, yeah. Also, guys, I wanted to tell you guys that I've changed my name from Roxy John to Ifama John, which is my name, my main name. I derived Roxy from my English name, which is Rosemary. So, I want to be answering my Igbo name. That's Ifama. I'm more comfortable with that. Not like I wasn't comfortable with Roxy John, but I just want to bear my real name or my native name. In my youtube channel so i hope you guys are also comfortable with that so going forward you guys are to call me ifoma 